<laughs> Brett was good. Um, I guess one of the matches I had with, with Brett, um, I was trying to uh, get fired, for lack of better words. Uh, and I was with, uh, with Brett on the afternoon show, and uh, I just told him, you know, they came and asked me to, to pee in a pee test, and I told him no because uh, I was trying to get out of the contract. And uh, so uh, Brett said finish up where uh, I went to um, – or he went to leap. I went to leapfrog him, and and uh, nutted myself, and uh, just took a, a count out. That was Brett's finish, you know, just to, because he knew, you know, I, I was just trying to get out and be as business as I could with it. So, but yeah. What was your contract for? Like, was it just uh, a year, or was it something like three years? No, it was it was just a one year con. Well, it was a one year contract, or maybe it was three years. I, I can't. I don't recall. But anyway, it it gave them the right to book me seven times for one hundred and fifty dollars per night, and pretty much it was it was just a, you know, back then there really weren't any contract contracts, just contracts to tie you up, and uh, so that contract um, just said and. And it said the territory was the world on it. So uh, I sued uh, WWF at the time. I actually won that that uh, lawsuit. So I filed in Tennessee. What was the what was the lawsuit over? I just wanted out of my contract. I just wanted out of the out of the contract because I wanted to go back to WCW at that time. Uh, they had switch uh personnel in the office and they were they were signing up um guys you know 150 grand a year uh brad uh pillman zinc z-man a lot of guys and and i'd gotten word they said come back here you know you they could use you down here so i, I just wanted to get out of it because they weren't doing anything with me up there so uh um went to the garden and i and, guess the pay would the pay would vary depending on how big the arena was well vince told me um in the gardens when i went to the gardens and they asked me to put um lombardi over and i said no then they said vince wants you in his office and he told me he didn't like me stirring shit up in his <laughs> in his dressing rooms and i said look i'm just trying to make a living and uh he told me I was going to make X amount of money. And I said, yeah, but 85 grand a year is not a lot when you're 265 days on the road with a hotel and food and, and, uh, gas and, and car rental car and all that. And I said, you know, I was better off just staying at home working at McDonald's. So anyway, he suspended me for two weeks, but I never went back. So. I was suit. wrestling Mr. Mr. Perfect Kurt Henning there. Oh, it was awesome. Awesome. Yeah, he, he was, he was, he was so good. And, um, uh, he, he liked working with me, he liked working with Brad. He, he said, man, he said, I wish we could do this every night. And I said, yeah, so do I. But, um, yeah, it, it, he was awesome. 